Welcome back to Keep RL, where Clarice and her friends are hanging out here in the leisure room. Actually, is Clarice there? No, it just looks like some minions. Anyway, that's not important right now. Let's see where she is. Yeah, she's down here. We've got some folks training. So, um, one of the things that was suggested this time by Jonathan Winoski was that we throw, whoops, uh, we throw an eyeball out here, which I knew eyeballs existed. I just never even thought about putting them out here, which is of course exactly what they're for. Oh, look, a swimmer and wolf companion goblin warrior. We'll take you. Uh, we will not take you vulnerable to magic. Okay, so let's throw an eyeball out. That is installations? Yes, and it's only 30 wood. And so we can put an eyeball right here. And then what will happen is then we can see as though we've got a minion standing here. Okay, meanwhile, I need to refresh my memory about where we are with stuff. So we've got people training down on level two, and we need more training dummies if we want to acquire more people. Let's throw everybody in here. The other thing I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to identify guards to leave back. Like, I'm not going to include everybody in our, in our uh, attack group. I'll leave guards here. But I'm not going to do that until there's a chance we're going to get raided, which is going to be a while. So let's go up here. This is the place. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's go down a little more. Okay, all right. So how are we for... Oh, let's pick up the pace. Okay, we've got a little wolf companion warrior. Let's make sure he gets... That's this guy. Let's make sure he gets equipment. He did. Okay, so what we really need to do today is try to figure out uh we need to find some iron honestly so let's see do we have iron down here we have iron right we have iron on this level so we're gonna have to risk it oh a shaman with extra stuff hates all elves that doesn't help us and we're also out of beds so we're gonna have to fix that but meanwhile let's just dig this out oh that's a little bit large hold on a minute No, that's what, what am I doing? What am I doing? I gotta get my brain together. <laughs> Clearly, it's a Monday. All right, I'm definitely having a case of the Mondays. Let's go over here and we're gonna dig straight down, or in this case, straight up from this iron. Hey, what is. There we go. Okay, and we'll just, we're still gonna put this in the center of the room. So we'll do this. Hey, what is happening? Oh, big. Oh my gosh. There we go. And then we'll dig all this out. This is our first iron of the, of, for Clarice. And of the playthrough. So that'll be great. We're gonna grab this stone as well. We're going to use the iron. We've actually kind of pre-allocated the iron, some of it anyway, on a prison and beast cages. I haven't put down the prison tiles, I don't think, but I've certainly put down the, the beast tile, uh, the beast cages. Resistant to magic priest. We already have a priest though, right? Yeah, we have a priest. We don't need these normal priests. This priest... Uh, has increased training limit too. Okay, let's go up here and we need to put down some more beds. So why don't we turn this uh, room into some barracks as well. We'll set it up exactly the way we did uh, the one beside it. And then we're, now we're not limited by beds anyway. And then we'll set up these private quarters later when somebody needs it. Do I want this goblin priest? I mean, it doesn't hurt to have two healers. You know what? We're going to take that second priest. How are we for stone? We might add some statues to increase our population. But we should be okay. I mean, the thing to remember is on this first level, on our home place... We should be able to take out whatever, whatever uh, question mark guys there are, whatever opponents there are. 
That Howling is our wolf companion, or our, our one of our dudes' wolf companions, one of our warriors. Okay, let's see. Let's check our our new priest and make sure it has stuff assigned gear. Okay, so we need to make some more stuff for this priest. So we'll just make a couple sets of everything so that we can grow <laughs> our people. And I like my guys to have torches. I don't think I made any last time. So we'll get to work on making all that stuff. <laughs> while our priest is training. Are we... Why is our priest so slow? Okay, so... Let's go down a level. And see... How we're doing on this iron. Okay, what else is in here? There's a question mark in here, so we do need to be careful. There it is right there. What are you? Hmm... Also resistant to magic, but we have enough priests. And we should... Yeah, okay, we're getting this iron. You're getting that iron. Okay, I'm going to cool it for a little bit. So the thing we need to be worried about really is as I dig down further, uh, running into guys that come up and attack us, we really don't have to worry very much about being raided for quite a while. This is an iron door set up to begin our prison. In fact, what I'll do is I'm going to set down some prison tiles. Prison. Okay. We need weapons for our minions. What are you talking about? We didn't make enough me weapons? Okay, have some more. I mean, those guys all have clubs. I don't know. What are you? Nope. Ah, we can recruit werewolves. So we used our iron. Yes. So we used our iron to make beast cages. Okay. We need iron training dummies, which we haven't made yet. And I don't think we can. Yeah, we can't do that until we get um, iron working. So that'll probably be the first thing we do. Although I also really like traps. But we should be able to do both without much trouble. Okay, I think we should gather the troops. I think we should gather the troops and go outside. Let's go attack. Let's take a look at this question mark here. And we should go scour the rest of our map. So let's put everybody in here. I think we need to put our priest in. Yeah. Okay, and we've got everybody else. So let's take control of... I, we could do Clarice, I guess. We're going to send Clarice over here. We'll go for the first question mark. Usually, in my experience, there are three areas of enemies on the starting area. I guess we went for a swim. So we're going to take them all out, of course. Ain't nothing in there. Now I'm going to... Where are all our guys? Where are you all? What are you doing down there? Okay, here we go. Here we go. Come on now. Eat it open, Clarice. So oh, this is a nice room. What did we get here? Six gold pieces. Oh, I broke up that table accidentally. But that's what that's what evil evil wizards do. They break up people's dinner. No dinner for you. Okay, well that was uh <laughs> Oh, what was that noise? Oh, that was us killing somebody. So that was kind of... Oh, okay, bandits. Okay. Priest is casting a spell. There's a key here. We'll take that key. We're going to collect all this stuff later. Okay, so it's bandits. Where are you going? Are you going across the water? Is that why you're taking so long? Okay, here we go. And it down. Okay, Clarice is not taking any damage, so we're fine. Usually, when I when when you lead with your uh -huh. minions freed from imprisonment. Ooh, I've never seen that before. Nice. Uh, usually, when you lead with your with your keeper, uh, it makes it very easy to take damage. So that's not a problem if you're 
patient, but I am not particularly patient, so I just slam into things. But we should be okay for now. Our keeper is by far strongest, uh, by far the strongest minion we have. Okay, let's go get the rest of this map. There's a boar down there. Okay, looks like we did clear this map. It's a little bit surprising. Yeah, I mean, this should be a human village, but we didn't take them out. There might be another... There might be another set of enemies in here somewhere. We can dig up to the stone and find out. But meanwhile, let's exit control mode. Okay, we killed a bunch of, of uh, enemies. Minions captured, but I think we released them. Yep, we did level up. So we're going to take iron working. And then the next one will be traps. So now... Uh, oh... Oh, we did actually get the human village. How interesting. Oh, we need to create some uh, graves. We need to create a cemetery. So let me get on that right now. Uh, let's go over here. Uh, actually, let's go down. And over here. And I don't know that we want the... Oh, yes, actually. Let's put the cemetery in here. Why not? A little graveyard over here. Right by your rooms. Right, not coffins. Okay, and then we'll put some ambiance in here. Let's do... Okay, let's put in... Wow, I really am moving slowly today. Let's put in... Some standing torches? Nah, let's just do torches. Okay, and we'll throw in a few more graves. Storage. Grave. Put them over here. You know, we ought to create the ambiance. And then... Torches outside and torches on the inside. Okay. And what else do we have? Damage training potential. Mm. We could do a more magic run than I did last time. That might be fun. I'm more used to... The, uh, for whatever reason, I am... I tend towards the the melee versus the versus the magic, but our keepers are wizards, so maybe we should do that. But since we took iron working, let's do training. Iron dummy. We're gonna put in a couple actually we'll put in a bunch of these. Why not? We've got the iron for it. And now we can pillage all of these corpses. It's important to get all those children corpses. Yeah, okay, we're, we're going... Oh, what do we need? Okay. Oh no, did I... What did I grab? Oh, right, we're at, we're at, at population max. But I grabbed something else. Did I accidentally grab another warrior? Oh, I think I grabbed the... Oh no! Did I grab this smelly breath warrior? I didn't mean to grab this smelly breath warrior. Oh. Wait, yeah. Oh no, I guess I did that last... Okay, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. I don't know. Let's build some... Uh, let's put in some statues. We can do up to four of these stone statues. And they provide... Oh, we're going to get more stone. They provide... They give us... They increase our population by one, so we'll get up to 12 once the second one is built. And they also provide some uh, some luxury for make these dedicated uh, dedicated quarters. Oh yeah, we're low on everything. All right, let's 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 send our imps up to do some stuff. So let's get this stone up here because we want to see if there's uh, more enemies up here. So we're gonna dig here. right up here. Yeah, this is clearly a day where I'm, I think I need some, some coffee. I don't normally drink it, but man, am I moving slowly today. Okay, so we're going to have our imps do that. Oh, look, they're offering us harpies too. Uh, harpies are cool because they can be archers, but we can't train them, so that's not all that helpful to us right now. So, 
Uh, let me see. You guys are training up. All right, and then the advantage of, of adding... Oh, wow, a zombie as well. We're not going to do zombies. In fact, I'm going to tell it... Don't even... Uh, Auto-reject zombies. Uh, that's this, right-clicking on it. I'm uh, auto-rejecting zombies because my experience is that they are so wimpy and so slow, you have to really commit to zombies and get their swarmer trait going before they can be of any benefit whatsoever. Okay, so let's go... We could get all of this wood here, and we do have... Yeah, why don't we get this wood? Whoa. There we go. Okay, we're going to get that wood. And we'll get the wood that's up here as well. Where's a good spot to come from? Oh, we have to bridge across. Well, I don't really want to use our stone to go get wood. Or I don't want to use our wood to get wood. Although, I guess we could. Why don't we just have our imps go up from here? Okay, it looks like the water runs over here. Let's find out. Could be an open room. Oh, the music just changed abruptly. That was strange. Okay, and then we are going to get this stone up here. Yeah. Oh, first of all, I've got to fix this problem. We don't have torches here. Can't exist in the dark. There's no style to it. Oh, I messed this up. Oh yeah, I messed up the shape of this room. Wow. Crazy. Let's dig up. Yeah, there's some business there. See, it didn't let me dig it all out. But that's okay. We'll find out. Uh, we can go up to very fast because we're not going to get raided. Look at all these good guys. I should have waited. Extra spell damage potential. All right, we're gonna do. A, we're gonna. I'm gonna try. Oh, a vampire warrior. Mm. I like them because you can situate them. You can make them guards, and they also are hard to damage. But they can't go out in the dark because they're undead. But if you leave them guards in your in your excuse me, they can't go in the light because they're they're undead. But uh, if you leave them as guards in your base then they can they don't ever they're not ever out in the light oh mummies as well i've never i don't think i've ever done mummies okay you guys do this um and i'm a little concerned about the question mark but we, we got to pick up the pace here so let's let's dig some stairs down i feel like i'm moving very slowly today oh a corridor okay this okay wait a second here I think we're going to let this imp. Oh my gosh, look at this great werewolf. Wow, okay. Okay, let's slow it down here. Okay, I took that werewolf. Ah, oh, okay. This question mark was a nice guy. That's what this, this uh, Barbu, the vampire warrior, let's find him. Let's find them. I guess they are here? Yeah, that was this question mark. Yes, that is... Or, or unless they're down one, no. Yeah, no. Here we are. So what we're going to do is we'll just grab Clarice and we'll take her downstairs. Yes, hello. Hi. I'm going to chat with you. All men be cursed. Yes, as a female, I agree. Okay, so now we've got these bookcases here. Now we could claim this. I don't know why we would necessarily, but we could claim this. And um, our, then our guys could train with them. I don't think we need to. But if we exit control mode, then you'll see we can recruit up to four vampires. Oh, it doesn't show four here, but oh yeah, it says four recruits. So... These Barbu, uh, are we, no, we can, we can, our guys can do that, I think. So now we can recruit four vampires that are, are already leveled up a little bit from the normal vampires that we would get, uh, at least in my experience. Um, oh, wow. Okay, exceeds damage, tra training potential. Uh, okay, well, we are getting really good recruits this time. Sometimes I get stuck waiting around for recruits. So let's, I'm going to tell our imps to dig out these rooms. 
And we're going to put down statues. We can do up to four stone statues. I want to keep the imps busy all the time. I mentioned that last time that I just sort of let the imps hang out and do nothing for a while. And, and I, I think we always want to be building. What, else, what other resources are down here? Oh, there's gold. Well, I think we're going to have to grab that gold. So let's do that. And we'll go from here. Okay, maybe there's something in the way here. Yeah, it won't let us dig there. So we may be running into some kind of water or an open room. Let's see what happens. I do hear water dripping, so that might be what it is. I mentioned it last playthrough, but um, the other thing we do want to be careful of is we want to use the gold. We don't want to just hoard the gold. I mean, if we're trying to play the game per se, rather than roleplay, we want to use the gold because raiding will be based uh, raids will be based on how much wealth you have, essentially. And so gold just sitting around in a pile is a lure to uh, a lot of enemies, so a lot of potential raiders. Look at all this wood. Let's clear, and one question mark. Let's clear this whole level out. I've, I've not really ever done something like that. We're going to go. We're going to go crazy on this level and see what happens. What are you? You're a mummy. Oh, no, you're a skeleton archer. We can't do anything with archers right now. I'm going to make this big. Super wide corridor. Maybe we'll do something with it later. And then we're going to pick up all this wood. No, I take it back. We're going to get rid of this corridor. It just slows down our imps. And two, in my experience, is enough. We've already given our imps quite a few jobs to do as well anyway. Let's take a look. Where are we? Okay, there is a question mark on this board. Let me see. Yep, okay, that's this. Let's grab... Let's grab these. And that is this right here, right? It is. Okay, so now we've got that we're taking out. This we're not doing yet. But I imagine we're going to bump into something before before we have a chance to dig this stuff out. But let's just see what happens. So you can see here, something's here. Oops. Okay, that ought to occupy our imps for a while. And we're probably going to hit whatever this question mark is. Let's quick check on our keeper. And let's make sure that everybody has enough stuff, in fact. Oh, we can make iron stuff now. I completely forgot. Let's, uh, uh, let's create a forge. Oh, and I forgot the poetry table. Where are limericks and haikus? Wow, I am definitely not doing well this time. Might as well put in a furnace, although, uh, it's not really going to help us all that much. How much? It's, that's, that's over 10% of our stone, too, but... That's okay. Okay, yeah, you do this. Furnace is, I mean, a uh, forge is made. So we want um, a few swords. I'm gonna make four of everything to begin with. Not gonna worry about acquiring guys. We're gonna go up to Z1. These, okay, yeah, our imps are still get, digging these out because I gave our imps so many orders, but we can put down another uh, stone statue. We can do, as I said before, we can do up to four of these. Well, we can do as many as we want, but uh, the first four will increase our population by one each. After that, you have to do the gold statues. I'm gonna do the same pattern. No, no, I am gonna break with my own tradition and do the opposite pattern, that's right. I'm a rebel like that. And we'll do this. We'll see how that looks. If it's ugly, we can rip it all up. Let's get torches in here. I wonder how they, what the algorithm is where they choose 
which to do first, like why they didn't do this one and they went over to this one. Uh, I suppose the source code is available, so we could just find that out if we really, really cared. Okay, so torch here, torch here, torch here, torch here, torch here, and torch here. Should be all set with that. We're gonna let this imp do its job. We have acquired only six gold, so we haven't mined any of that gold. We're still in pretty good shape with the iron and the stone. Oh, and what we're gonna do? Taro Opress uh, uh, in the comment section on last episode suggested that we could get extra luxury by putting in by putting in uh, stone walls. Are these? No, uh, by putting in something has luxury, some kind of wall, stone pillar. No, that, those are roof supports. Wooden pillar. Okay, well I'll have to figure it out. But we can put them in and as as intermediate walls here, and then they will add luxury to the room. I will I will take another look. But we don't have to do it right now because we can do it kind of anytime we want, and nobody wants their own room yet anyway. Vampire Warrior. We're above our population limit. This hasn't been built. Yeah, I gave the imps too many orders this time. Let's go see how we're doing down here on our board with the question mark. Okay, we've got one imp working on this. Yeah, I've given them a ton of orders. So I don't I, I don't know that I necessarily want to be super patient on this go-round. I think uh, I think we're gonna take everybody. Put our werewolf in the group here. Whoops, put our werewolf in the group. Think we have both wizards? No, we didn't have both wizards. Oh, why are you only 21? Are you not trained yet? Have a Corinthum? Okay, alright. Why are you... F oh, you're a warrior, that's why. Okay, we've got everybody in our group. We are gonna go fight somebody. I just think it might be foolhardy, but I don't think Clarice is the is the kind of, of lady who's gonna wait around. I don't think she's going to be patient. So let's go to the map. Let's go... Oh, let's go meet our allies. Yes. Let's go. Okay, we're going to control Clarice. And we're going to go to see our allies, the Dark Elves. Here we are. We can... Okay, four question marks on here. Now, this is risky. Uh, if you haven't watched any other Keeper RL, this is risky because though our allies are on this this map, so are some enemies. So it's definitely possible we will encounter uh, enemies that are too tough for us. But um, Clarice is a risk taker, I think. Let's take another look at these question marks. Okay, we're going to follow... Oh wow, it looks like, looks like we're going to be blocked off. Let's see what happens. Yes, it does look that way. Oh, uh, all you guys, wait a second. You have to come around? Yeah, okay, we are. We are, It certainly looks like we're blocked off. We're no longer rested. Can we get into this mountain? No, oh boy. Where are these dark elf allies of ours? Okay, I'm gonna use the keyboard to be a little more cautious. So, wow, wow, okay. Well, we'll take this mushroom in case we ever get to making potions. Oh boy, are we locked out entirely? Okay, let's take another look at the map. It does look like we are. Well, how does that work? Is this shallow water? Can we walk in this? No, not all of our minions can walk in here. Wow, these dark elves have really hidden themselves, huh? Okay, let me make sure I haven't missed a an entrance here. Wait, what's this about? Okay, hmm. I don't know that I've ever seen, I mean, not that I've played a ton of Keeper RL, but I don't know I've ever seen a situation where you have to come to the other map and you're forced to dig. 
I'm not even sure you can bring imps along to do that. So maybe we need some way of, of being able to cross this water? Let's see. Uh, I did this whole area. Oh, wait. That might be an entrance right there. Okay, let's go down there. Somehow, I, I guess I missed it. Yes, oh my gosh, here it is. We were right here. Okay, everybody catch up, please. Thank you. All right. Here we go, Clarice. Dwarves. Those bastards. Okay, we're gonna order their capture. Mentally unstable. Well, we're gonna order your capture anyway. Okay, we're gonna... Uh, Clarice has a magic missile, so she's gonna use it on this dwarf. Okay, and then she is gonna back off. I don't think... Oh, well, I don't think the priest should be doing the fighting. Maybe I should take control of one of our warriors. Yes, let's switch leader. You're coming up here. You don't really want to get stuck in these corridors. You, you want to be able to... Although, actually, this is working out as a good choke point because now it's one against one of them against two of us. We're going to order your capture. All right, the tribe of figs, the dwarf is destroyed. Very nice. Now we we don't really care about these peasants. Although we could order their capture. Oh look, it looks like there's kobolds there. Aren't those kobolds? Yeah, kobolds. Okay, this is another another tribe. Let's order. The, yeah, we're going to order the leaders capture. We'll order them captured. Why is Clarice up here? What are you doing, Clarice? You better not be taking damage. You know what? Let's... Oh, no. Well, yeah, we're going to take this dwarf peasant. They can work like imps for us. Once they are our prisoners. This is going to work well. Okay, the tribe of kobolds is destroyed. Oh, maybe there were two tribes of kobolds. Okay, so now we're going to do something a little different. We're actually going to disband because we captured these five people. Oh, I hope we've built our, our prison tiles. And then we're going to go back to our, uh, our prison area. That's right here. Yes, we have. So now we can capture these dwarf prisoners and these cobalt prisoners. Now the, the, the thing we have to be careful of, oh yeah, look at that, oh yeah, okay. We're gonna take this prisoner, this prisoner, and this prisoner. We have to be careful to not overwhelm ourselves with too many prisoners and, and have a um, jailbreak risk. But I think we'll be okay, unless we get you know decimated in some other way. So we're gonna let everybody come back that was good. That was good. And we leveled. So now, do we do, do we do traps or do we do advanced sorcery? We have two wizards, a shaman, and two priests. We are going more magic than I typically do, although we obviously have goblin warriors too. And traps are incredibly useful. But I think we go advanced sorcery, unless we want to do archery. Oh, there's so many good choices. No, we're gonna do advanced sorcery. This way they can all level up. All our magic users can level up. So we need to create, we need to create iron bookcases. We should have plenty of iron for this. We're gonna put them in the corner. There are more efficient ways to do this stuff. Like because I've got walls around these, you can't have as many people work on them, but that's okay. Okay, we don't care about this mommy. This goblin warrior. Oh, see now this is, I haven't, I haven't practiced doing in, insane Management, but plus 13 damage. Okay, I gotta think about this. I gotta think about this because um, both Jonathan and Taro suggested that I could absolutely manage these insane warriors and have them be useful. I think what we're gonna first do is the mistake I made before or last uh, with, with uh, Zacharias of Ghoul and Bursty in the last series is I didn't take an insane artificer and we're gonna need that once we get Admantium. So, I'm going to create quarters for an artificer. But I think we're at the... Didn't we determine this is the... Yeah. So, we're going to create quarters for an artificer. 
we'll do uh let's do five by five and then attach a room and then five by five and then this will be the crafting area and this will be the living area for that artificer so we'll have it all set when when we get that artificer Uh, we can we can go up to very fast. Yes, and you can see up here from all these messages, although they're probably very very difficult for you to read on on whatever screen you're on, that our guys are training. All our magic users are training. This goblin warrior. Yeah, this is okay. I'm gonna set aside that one for now. Now, what I do want to do, uh, you know, we've got four vampire warriors in reserve. <laughs> So I'm not going to worry too much about home defense. I think I'm just going to use the vampire vampires as home defense. Actually, we're going to... Oh. Extra spell damage potential. Fine. Oh my gosh. I'm just burning through all of our population limits. We need... Okay, let me... Oh, this is much uglier than this. Actually, come to think of it, they're both kind of ugly. Whatever. An imp is killed by a dwarf. What happened? What is this? Oh. 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 Look at that. Wait, are you... Figs the dwarf. Captured from a hostile tribe. Cobalt. Okay, wait, who, what? Where are these imps killed by dwarves? Is there... What is happening here? Yeah, look at all these corpses. I think we need to gather our troops. Let's bring them down here. Yeah, we'll, we'll leave with Gorbag. And... That was level 4, correct? Wait. Yes. Yes, it was. Okay, so let's go over here. What is this? Okay, we found a settlement. No, we don't need to break down the... That... Okay, bad dudes. Bad dudes, okay. Let me see. Uh, you know what? I think we have enough prisoners for now. Unless we find somebody with like a 50 forge. Which we'll need for adamantine. We're going to just kill everyone. Yeah, you're a prisoner. Okay. Well, we're going to have to recruit new imps. But that's okay. Imps, the first four imps are free, so you can always replenish. Come back here. Okay, you're done. Let's make sure we've cleared out everybody to make sure it's safe for our workers. Okay, there's an imp running around down here. We've got our friends mining while we do this. I suppose I could have turned that off. We're going to clear this whole thing out. Yes. Okay. I think we're okay. Yeah, I think we're okay. So we're going to disband. And we killed all those enemies, those bastards. Um, okay, all this stuff is going to go up here. You know... Maybe what we do, it seems a little cheese, but maybe we have resource storage right there. And then they can just stack resources right there. Let's see if that works. But does this actually need to be built? Let me see if I can prioritize this task. Yes, look at that. Okay, that seems like I'm, I'm taking a little bit of an advantage, but that's okay. I mean, I, I don't think it's that big a deal. We've claimed all of this because we mined it out. We can take these corpses, but I don't think we need to. Is there anything up here we want? Just corpses, just corpses. Okay, well, let's dig this out. Okay, well, that was exciting. That was definitely exciting. Let's take this stone because we can. 
And what else? Yeah, I did say I wanted to mine out this whole level, so we're going to. I'm going to take everything. Uh, we'll go from here. Okay, there's something there. Whoops. There's something there. There we go. Okay, let's zoom back in. What do we have for warriors? Artificer. Insane smelly breath plus 24. So this is this This is an artificer we would want. Uh, let's go. Oh boy. Okay, hold on a second. I'm gonna go on normal speed. We're gonna go up to level one. We're gonna go over here and see how our soon-to-be artificer plans are going. Yeah, this space here. Okay, so this is where we would bring our, our artificer. So first we're gonna put in a door. Then we're going to put down some floors for this artificer. So we're going to make it. We're going to give this artificer luxury barracks or a luxury um, a dedicated room to live in. Uh, we're going to have this door here. Whoops! What did I do wrong there? There we go. Wooden door. Wooden door. Then I don't think we care too much about wooden floors here, although we do have the wood for it. So let's go crazy. Wood floor. Okay, but we're going to make it... Oh, you know what? Hold on. Let's do Let's do a different pattern here. Yeah, that'd be nice. Okay, and then we're going to do some torches in the crafting area. We're going to do a bed. How much gold do we have? Only six. So we're going to do a fine bed right in the center. We're going to do standing torches, which give some luxury in the corners here. And we'll even give, uh, where is, where is, why am I not seeing it? Is it under living? Dining table. We even put a dining table in here, put it in the corner. What else is under living? Uh, right. Okay. And installations. How about a nice fountain for this guy? Okay, so artificer, should we take him now? Okay, wait a minute. So he's plus twenty forge. Let's go look at our other artificer. I'm not sure if that if we look at this artificer, it says uh, thirty for forge, but it also gets plus twenty. So let's take a look at this artificer. Okay, so the twenty is not taken into account. I don't know what smelly breath does, but we're going to find out. Oh boy, exceeds population limit. Okay, we're going to have to wait for the next one. I don't have time to build another another uh, statue. Oh, that was a little bit of a miscalculation, but that's okay. We we, we don't need it yet anyway because we don't have we don't have uh, adamanty. Let's put down another stone statue, and now I just need to remember that we are out. Oh, look at this. There's water here. Hmm. Let's. Let's build a wall. Let's wall that off. Actually, we'll just do wood wall. It's okay. Wood wall. Wood wall. So that'll close that off. Let's put in the torches like we like to. Okay, we're good there. We're gonna leave this one for now. We can set it up later. Nobody's snobbish yet anyway. So we should be fine. Yeah, this floor is ugly. This floor is just much uglier than this. So we're not gonna. That's a that's a pattern we're not doing anymore. But maybe we'll do this big X. We'll try that out. Although we can't do it here because we're building this wall to wall it off. But that's okay. Oh, it looks like we can put floor underneath. Ah, eh, we're never going to see it under this wall. Okay. And since we're doing it, let's put... How much? No, we don't have a lot of iron. So we're going to do basic beds up here in each of these rooms. So that when, we're, when we need, when we need uh, quarters, we'll already have them ready. And let's put doors in because, you know, you gotta have a door for your bedroom.
Okay, we've got people writing poems. Got haikus coming up. Limericks. Very nice, very nice. Okay, so we're waiting for... We're waiting for a... Insane Artificer. Let's finish up this room. Okay, we need crafting here. So let's do that. Crafting... Uh, forge. This will be the main focus. And we can have... I, I think we just want the Artificer doing forging. Okay, we're going to need a door right here. And then what we'll do is, when we recruit the Artificer, we'll send that Artificer into here, lock this door, let it do its thing, and then when it needs time, when it's time to pick things up, we lock them in a bedroom. I see that... Who is this? Dushnag has just decided to commandeer this bed. Which is a little ridiculous, but whatever. Whatever. Not hurting anybody, I guess. Okay, this is more stone that we haven't mined because I didn't go grab it. So we'll get that stone. What we really need, though, is iron. So let's go down a little. Let's see what we've got here. Uh, so it's just stone. This is just wood. Oh, and it's across the... All right, let's see where this water goes. Let's see, we're going to dig out all of this to see where the water goes. Because ultimately we want to come up here. I don't think we're going to be able to cross this. Yeah. But we'll, we'll see what happens. And then uh, I think it's time to go down a level. That's over here. Oops. There we go. Okay, yeah, let's put in the torches. I have been bad at my torch doing job here. And pretty mellow episode today, but... Whoops. But things will pick up the pace. And we we did definitely, you know, we did actually go and increase our malevolence level by two levels. No, no thank you. No thank you. We should have room for one more. Yes, we have room for one more. I think we're going to reserve that for the Artificer. Let's make sure that we have enough equipment, though. So let's go up to level one. Oh, sorry. We're going to need to go to level two. And we'll go over here. Actually, let's check how everybody's doing before we, before I go crazy making stuff. Like, do you have a Coranthum? You do not. Oh, that's, wait, hold on. Where's my wizard? Yeah, 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 yeah. No, you need, okay, so we need to, we need to make the Coranthums. Oh, we can make ornate ones, but we don't have enough gold. So let's make a few of these. Make a few more torches. We're, you know, we can afford it. Uh, we don't want to make too much more leather anything because we can make iron but let's let's keep extra stuff around so we don't find ourselves kind of needing to make things in a hurry that's gonna use a lot of our iron yeah that's using all of our iron more than all of our iron so we definitely need to be digging down I've given the imps a lot of stuff to do and I was on slow or I was on normal which is slow what is this Wooden arms. Pair of wooden arms? Were they building an automaton? Pair of wooden legs? Wooden drill. Cool. I haven't done anything with the automations. So, we'll probably do that next playthrough or, or well, we'll do it at some point because I'm just going to keep doing, as far as I'm concerned, I'm just going to keep doing some Keeper RL. Keep some series going all the time. This game is just so interesting. Okay, so... We've got iron here, iron here, gold, and a question mark. So we're going to go down another level. As much as I want the iron, I also want to find the adamantine. So let's go downstairs, please. But we will drop in some torches, of course, because that's kind of a must-do thing. Let's see. Let, let's take a look, because we do we do need iron pretty badly. Why don't we send Why don't we send you out this way? There's the iron, so we're gonna take that.
there we go. We'll get that iron. And, uh, you know, let's extend this corridor out here. To get this iron. Okay, I hear water dripping and it seems we can't dig this way. So that could be... That could be water, or it could be a corridor for this question mark, bad dude. We're going to assume that they're always bad dudes because they are, oops, they are typically bad dudes. Okay, no, 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 thank you. Yeah, dig all that out, please. Oh, wait a minute. Did I acquire more imps? I did not. Let's go. Two, three imps. Now to acquire another one, we would need 30 gold. See, and the prisoners are, are digging for us too. They become our workers. And so that's just great. What are you? Warrior. Disarms traps. That would be nice to have. Roll to magic. That would not be great to have. But we're not taking another warrior right now, unless I want to kill somebody off, which I don't. Let's go down a level. Okay, still no adamantine. That's a funny shape. Um, how are we for wood? We're still good on wood. So what we're going to do is just dig this out a little. These don't need to be this big. Why am I doing these this, this big? Let's do... There we go. Let's do that. Do one extra. And then we're going to throw down stairs. What do we have here? Still no adamantine. So we're going to... There is gold, though. We're going to grab this gold for sure. Are we paused? Why are they not doing the other stairs? Oh, there it is. Okay, so let's do same business. And we're going to go straight up. Yeah, there's our gold. Notice it's already our gold. Grab all that gold, please. Wait a minute, what happened? Oh, I did it wrong. That's what happened. all of that. We don't need you to be wasting cycles on this. Okay. Yeah, get in there. Dig all this out. Get all that gold for us. Yeah, we definitely need the gold. We also told them to get more gold somewhere else, but I keep giving them so many jobs. Or maybe that got cancelled. I'll have to go take a look. Look, I screwed this up too. There we go. Me. I will do corners this time. Why not? No, don't build that. Thanks. Okay, so we don't need... Yeah, okay, that's fine. Okay, build that. And we want more stairs down. There's a little risk here that we're going to expose ourselves to somebody that can attack from below. But I'm willing to take that risk. I want to move a little bit quicker. Okay, we've got some iron. We've got some wood. We've got some stone. So we're good in all cases. Not taking any of these guys. Let's go up and just take a look at where that gold is. Did I not dig out to this gold? Oh, that's strange. I thought I had. Maybe we got attacked first. Let's do that. Let's go grab that gold. Get them digging over here. They'll get that gold for us. That's good. What else is on this map that we can take? Might as well get all this stone. Oops. There we go. Okay, you'll get that for us. And what is the... Oh, that's right. There's a question mark on this board. Let's see what happens. Uh, Harpy disarms traps. That would be nice, but we're not. We're only in the market right now for an insane artificer. Other than that, I think we're in good shape. We're going to get this stone, though. 
Wait, these are our prisoners are our imps. Our workers. Let's call them our workers. Even though a worker even though worker implies you get paid, which uh, these these guys definitely do not. Um, our workers will get this taken care of. Yeah, and I am gonna try. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. I, it, it, it's a little bit of a cheese mechanism to knowing that the way storage works is if it's in a storage facility, then it then it's automatically part of your available assets or available resources. Okay, wait a minute. Oh, it's a priest. Oh, spell damage potential. Fine. We took that priest. We're gonna drop that priest in here. Now we're gonna go look at our priests. You seven. Okay, so Lord Bub, I hate to break it to you, but um, you're gonna meet with an unfortunate end. So commands, drop everything, and then come over here. And you are gonna go in this water. Oh no, Lorbub died. How unfortunate. Telepathic flying entertainer? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, let's make a coffin. Um, let's go to our graveyard. Yeah, we're gonna... Uh, no, you know what? We're gonna store coffins over here. So, living basic coffin. Actually, let's do fine coffin. No, 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 no. Living. Basic coffin. Because we're not making a dedicated room for this guy yet. And we're actually going to create a few coffins. This will be our vampire barracks. We're going to say orders, prioritize task on this coffin. We will throw in some torches, although I don't know if that has a positive or negative impact on, on vampires. Let's let this get made here. And as soon as we can, we're going to take this vampire. Here comes a, a dwarf prisoner to create that coffin. And there we go. So now we are full again. So I need to figure out somebody to get rid of because we don't have an easy way to... We don't have an easy way to add more population until we get gold. Oh! Well, speak of the devil. Let's okay. So we're definitely only going to use only going to use this extra population. This is what I'm going to claim. We're going to use this extra population to get our insane artificer. Oh, we're going to need more walls here. Structure. Uh, that was a wooden wall, right? Okay, our imps are, are responding quickly, which probably means they don't have enough work to do. Although, aren't they digging the gold here? Yeah, they are. Okay, let's go here. Let's set up the... Let's set up the wood. I mean, the floors, excuse me. Uh, wood floor. door on this and we're going to do floors these floors oh what happened Get these floors oh that looks like an artificer to me hold please goblin artificer goblin artificer yes i can say goblin okay we're taking you we took you okay okay we need to get up here i've paused it we need to get up here here's our artificer we're going to take control of you Okay, this is the first time I'm doing this, but but I've got good advice. So let's go up here. Wait a minute. Is this not... No, no, no. We need to go down a level. There we go. We're going to go in here. Okay. Now, lock that door. Uh, and you are in here. We got it. So now, as soon as we find adamantine, oh wait, hold on, I need to, 
I need to zone this as quarters for you. Who are you? You are Karam, the goblin, art goblin artificer. So now we're going to assign Karam. That's, that's Malkul. There you are, Karam. Quarters. That's your quarters. Enjoy, my friend. Enjoy. Don't go crazy. Okay. Very, very nice. What is the total luxury of this? 3.9. That's good. Okay, let's... Uh, sorry, now we can pick up the pace. Oh, now I'm so excited. So once we find Adamantine, we can, we can build stuff. Or we can forge stuff. Excuse me. And in fact, on that note, on that lovely note that we've got a an insane artificer, so we're prepared with adamantine. I'm going to call it an episode. Thank you so much for your support and your viewership. I love you very much. Please remember to have your pet spayed or neutered. And if you feel like it, like this video and subscribe. And obviously, I value all comments from the comment section. It's been super helpful to get that support and guidance from people. So you should feel free to offer comments as well. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.